Hey guys, it's Eric and Christian here, and we're back for another round of parent videos. Um, it's the month of October, and that's why we're wearing masks, because there's apparently a uh, holiday this, this month, right? Um, we just finished four weeks on friendships, and we had great conversations with your students. Hopefully you guys uh, used some of our tips and had good conversations with your students at home as well. And we are going to be talking about something new coming up here at the beginning of October. Uh, we're talking about identity. And what better month to talk about identity than the month of October, right? We got uh, a whole holiday designed for us to change the identity of who we are and get the opportunity to dress up and be whatever we want to be. I, I like to be a lion and I'm going to be a tiger. Perfect. Um, but we also know that your students sometimes have the same tendency to, to try to dress up and put on a mask uh, when they're at school and be somebody different than who they really are. And we're going to encourage them this, uh, this month to actually take off their masks and just be themselves. As your students go through life, they're going to have all kinds of people telling them how to get love, how to get money, how to get power, how to get happiness. There's all sorts of influences coming in on your student as they grow up um, to identify as various different things. And um, there's also a lot of pressure from social media. Uh, there's everybody and their brothers out there living their best life and they're showing you only the good parts of their life and it's hard to keep up with those people if we believe that that is in fact their best life um, but what we want to really focus in on is what does God say what does he say about who you are and about who he wants you to be so over the next four weeks we're gonna look at four new topics about identity and the first one is we're gonna look at is that we all have a past and we're gonna look at that we all have today we all have a future and we all have family. And specifically how we're going to look into those things is we're going to look at the story of Moses and see um, how he connects with each one of those four topics. And then ideally what we want to do is we want to see what God did for Moses in those areas and then what can we learn from that? What can God do in our lives um, uh, regarding our identity and that? And once again this month, what we want you guys to do as parents is to be asking questions. And so Eric's going to give you a, a few questions that you can an, uh, ask your students uh, maybe around the dinner table this month. All right, so some questions you could talk to your students about this month that will relate to our topic. Um, which one of your friends do you feel like you can be yourself around? Are there any of your friends that you feel insecure around? Do you have any new hobbies or passions? Do you believe that your classmates are being honest online about who they really are? Um, again, these are tools for you to get connected with your students. We want you to take the time to um, talk to them. It's awesome when it connects to what they're learning in uh, Sunday school, and we want you guys to be able to um, help us to, to help them figure out who they are and uh, who God says they should be. Um, lastly, we want to leave you with a uh, chunk or treat. Uh, that is a big event coming up at the end of this year, or the end of this month, and we are going to be um, putting out a bunch of cars, we're going to be handing out a bunch of candy. Last year, uh, you may have been there, and the junior high department uh, put on a huge pirate ship in the back of my truck with like a 10-foot mast and a uh, huge pirate flag. It was a lot of fun. And this year, we're challenging the high schoolers to get involved and get a car and get out there and see if they can do anything worthwhile. <laughs> worthwhile. <laughs> Ours is going to be so good. Like, we've got students that are older. They've gone through the process. That, we've got designers. I think we're going to have a great, a great, I don't know, truck or car or van or coffin. I don't know what we're going to have, but it's going to be amazing. We'll let the votes speak for themselves, but junior high's got this in the bag. We've got experience. <laughs> True, true. So we hope to see you all out there. We're excited to have you as part of our group, and we look forward to all the conversations.